Hi, this is Lindworth playing games while rambling incoherently into a microphone. Why? Well, just because I can. And they continue with Still Life 2 Blind. I could have sworn I there was an icon to look at this before. Uh, I'm supposed to check out the killer's computer, which I guess is what I will do. I imagine this is probably blocked. Oh. No, it isn't. Can I go back? Mm, I can. Mm, so, to be honest, before I check out the computer, let me take a look around here. Is there anything useful in here? Mm, storage in here. A little note left by the killer. What a jerk. Mm, okay. Seemingly there is not much around here. Which makes me question why am I even allowed to explore this if there's nothing significant. shows the line is being jammed. My smartphone, too. Oh, shit. The password has changed. Congratulations, McPherson. You are still alive. You are tougher than the others. You're not wasting any time, asshole. Sooner or later, the FBI will get here. Exactly. I have a schedule to keep. Stay where you are, McPherson. I have a bullet with your name on it. Okay, new objective, which is what exactly? Run away? Hide? Escape from the killer? What was that? What, what was the game showing me? Can I hide in this? Like, that's a very obvious hiding place, to be honest. I, I don't think it would have worked. Where are you hiding, McPherson? In this drawer? Nope, that's not you. This one's already dead.
Okay, he, he, he must actually be pretty dumb for this to work. I have to finish this asshole. Since he's laid traps in the house, I might as well use them. I have to be smarter than him. If I want to lure him somewhere, I can always call him with my smartphone. I've got his number. Hmm. Trap the killer. There's no more choices, it's either him or me. I have to find a way to neutralize. Maybe I could use one of his traps against him. Now, the mines uh, in the backyard mm, are still mm, operational. Although, well, I guess that wouldn't work because once I pull off the object that's on them, uh, they're going to explode. So. <laughs> Let me think about it for a second. I'm not sure if I'm on a timer here. Um, <laughs> maybe I can reinitialize the electricity on the thing magic. I do still have the keypad, right? I do. Since the, the mines are not going to work, um, those traps are all neutralized as well. Still alive. You will only have one chance. The end is near. Call the killer. Um, wait, but the, all those messages I've had before, so what's the new message? Uh, trap the killer. I'll try fiddling with the fuse box right here. As, as I said, the mines are not really helpful to me because uh, they are blocked currently in a very obvious way and once I pull it off, um, they are going to explode, so... And maybe if I... Uh, put this back... Um, and then, then rearm it... Pattern and some initials. They were probably carved by the killer. Uh, now, luckily for me, I have written down the... Uh, it was 845... Uh, 8541 the the code near the symbol uh, which i'm pretty sure would be what i what i need to oh okay that doesn't hmm. this base is connected to the keypad box i just have to find what can be plugged into it okay i'm rather confused i have a battery i guess which i cannot Hmm. I can't use the remote if it's not initialized. Okay, so let's try now. Uh, 8451. Uh, wait. No, no, it was 8541, right? 8541. It looks like the remote is on, so I'll be able to use it. Uh, wait, but is that a remote control for what? If I can take it out, what, what does it, what does it do then? I was under the impression this is some kind of a. Mm, mm, th th this would re-enable the electricity that goes through this. W what happens if I take this? Initialize remote control. Mm. Yeah, what now? Like, how does how does that help me? It's a remote for what? Like for 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 sending electricity through this. It can't. 
currently doesn't work. Okay, it does something, but I'm unsure of what exactly that is. Like, surely I've done something because, you know, the option to reinitialize it wouldn't exist if it wasn't doing anything. Oh, this won't help me. Like, I'm confused about what exactly is it that I'm trying to accomplish here with that. With this. Like, it, it's a remote control for something, but I'm not sure what. If it is for the gate, then maybe I can time it w when he's, like, near it or whatever. I'm not sure. I will call it, you know, worst case scenario, I'll just reload. When he kills me. Mm. I'm outside, behind the house. Come find me, if you got the balls. It's about time. He's dead. The world will be a better place without him. I might as well go get Hernandez now. When she's out of danger, I'll try to find Garrus. Are you sure he's dead though? Like have you actually have you have you actually checked? I would have preferred to arrest him by the book, but he didn't give me a choice. Have you actually checked his like life signs? Killer's electronic key. Okay, that's for the other door in the that's for the other door. I would have preferred to arrest him by the book, but he didn't give me a choice. Is there anything else on him? A folded piece of paper with something scribbled on it. Nam like co? A folded piece of paper with something scribbled on it. Nam like co? Uh, Nam like co. That's a, that's a new pass password for... I imagine... Is the hatch locked? Like, it was open before, to be honest. Uh, it's impossible to open. Uh, okay, so I imagine this is probably a new password for the hatch. Although, I have to say, I'm going to say this in advance. If the killer turns out not to really be dead, I am going to be really annoyed. Mm. Because it seems to me it would be standard freaking police procedure to check if he's actually dead before, uh, you know, leave, leaving him. Like, why? You know, worst case scenario, uh, just, just, just cuff him, you know, tie him with something. If he's a corpse, it doesn't matter, but if he isn't, why would you leave it, uh, you know, on a chance like that? If, if he turns out to be alive and comes back to uh, take his revenge on me, I am going to be very annoyed with this game. So he better not be alive. Oh, there's a Carson file. Any new photos or videos?
Nope, those are all old. Carson file. This file was not available the first time I accessed the computer. Uh, University of Southern California uh, reg registrar's file. Uh, Carson David, mm, birth date. Uh, May 31st, 1971, requested department film, application date, June 27th, 1990, evaluation favorable, applicant certification, uh, um, are, are complete and to the best of my knowledge, uh, design, denial of my admission, subject to blah blah blah, I agree to produce certified documents, um, okay that's his photo I guess. A driver's license, car registry, blah blah blah. So, this is the face of David Carson. Shit! He's the prisoner from the shelter! This asshole pretended to be one of the killer's victims. Oh, and to think I left him downstairs with Hernandez! Wait, 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 wait. So, who. Okay, that brings me to another very stupid point. Uh. I didn't even check his actual face um, when I supposedly killed him and now it turns out I killed some other person uh, I guess it must be his accomplice if it was his victim I'm not sure what he could have done outside of literal mind control to force someone to actively hunt me down at least without sounding apologetic about it. You know, I could imagine a situation where, for example, you had like an explosive implanted in your head or whatever uh, that would kill you and he would be like, go and hunt her down and kill her or I will kill you. But if I was in that situation, I would be like, I have to do it. I, you know, run away. I'm trying to kill you because I have to. He will kill me if I do not try, but I'm giving you a heads up and please, you know, evacuate yourself from this area. Uh, so... Uh, and I wonder what would have happened... Uh, would it be a different ending if I didn't check that? Because it seems totally... Um, it seems totally... Uh, you know, arbitrary, actually. Uh, it was this, right? Have, have, has it changed? No. Uh, uh, and, and totally optional to check that file. So if I didn't check it, I wouldn't know that the guy that I killed is, is not him. Uh, which is a pretty dramatic change, actually. Although, again, that makes me kind of mad that she didn't even check uh, who the person she supposedly killed was. Like, why wouldn't you check it? And and there should have been, uh, you know, a more detailed scene of her like checking for vitals, because as is, mm, it seems to me that she kind of just assumed he's dead. Oh, no, 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 I'm, hmm. Actually, I didn't want to go here yet, because... I would have preferred to arrest him by the book, but he didn't give me a choice. Yeah, she, she's I would have still... I would have, I would have preferred... She still wouldn't check. There are barely legible initials on the back of this glove. S-S-P. Those letters again. A folded piece of paper with something scribbled on it. Nam let co. A folded piece of paper. Okay, this is this is all pretty dumb, but before I go back downstairs, no, no, no. Can I reload? Do do I even have a previous save in like a? good position. 
Uh, where? No, no, I don't want to save. Because what I wanted to do... Where is this? It's before I called him. Uh, what I wanted to do is to take all of my other stuff from the storage upstairs, because I might need it. I'm outside. He's... I would have preferred to arrest... There are bare... A folded piece of paper... There are... Oh, oh wait, maybe this, this door just doesn't work. Or maybe I have... Okay, I might, I, I might actually be dumb. I might actually be super dumb. Uh, will... The other save... Because this is after, right? So that, that would save me the trip to... Uh, to the thing magic. Mm. Uh, join Hernandez and the prisoner in the shelter. No, wait, this is. I'm pretty sure this is a an override of the previous save, so I have to. Okay, this is pretty pretty dumb of me. I think I have to go to the basement anyway. The the reason why I couldn't click on the doors, I guess, is because. Mm, uh, because I didn't click on the stairs first. I guess the save was before I looked at the body. And to think, all of this is entirely pointless because, because I only reloaded because I was st stupid enough not to notice I couldn't open the door just because I didn't click on the staircase beforehand. Okay, I have to pause for a second, be right back. Okay, I'm back. So, I was going down here, right? of David Carson. Shit! He's the pr- this asshole. Great, I broke the game. Hernandez? There's no one here. Where'd they go? I will leave a couple of things in here. Uh, specifically this 
and one set of this. An empty amphetamine box. <laughs> I've had my dose. Played along so we'd trust him. Film books. Carson's favorite. Uh, I could unscrew this, probably. Bad idea. Welded shut. I wonder where this ventilation shaft leads. Okay, if it's welded shut, then I most likely can't unscrew it on account of it not having any screws. There's no doubt about it, this guy's a real psychopath. Looks like this grate was used as a weapon. I must take a sample of this clue. Mm, but I don't have my CSI kit. for this. Looks like he really had some fun with Hernandez. She was lucky to get away. There's a unit flag that matches the carvings I saw. United States Marine Corps Scout Sniper Platoon. Magazines. Ooh, intellectual stuff. Magazines. Ooh, intellectual stuff. Military music. A loaded gun is somewhat more useful. Okay, I do have plenty of those already, to be honest. A map showing the traps installed in the house. That would have been helpful to have before. Probably use it. Mm, okay, I'll take the adhesive uh, tape. Mm, it seems like something that would be very useful to have. I have a, I have a pocket knife already. Um, Electronics books. Crossbow. The killer must have used this to shoot at me. Call me old school, but I prefer a gun any day. Computer books. A police report. Interesting. So this is the man who died electrocuted by his own trap. Uh, Vincent Galateri, a reporting officer. Individuals concerned. Henry Stanwell and Terence Curtis. 
circumstances, Curtis was accused of hitting and injuring Henry and Tom Stanwell. He was arrested at 5 a.m. in a rented apartment in Queens. Officers Alistair and Sanchez proceeded with the arrest. Curtis tried to res resist the officers, and the officers had to use the f uh, use force to subdue him. Please note that Special Agent James Hawker, attached to the FBI, was present at the time of the arrest. He wanted to question Curtis for a federal, federal investigation, a state of the proceedings. Appearance scheduled for September 20th, proceeding cancelled, the plaintiff having withdrawn his complaint. Terence Curtis? What has he got to do with this story? A report detailing the killer's modus operandi. Uh, use of an incapacitating substance for the abduction. Lock up the victim in the room upstairs. Place the collar around the neck. Prepare narcotic drugs. Um, prepare something to tie up the victims. Film the tortures. Physical and psychological suffering. Killing a bullet to the head. Edit the video. Clean the body. Erase all compromising evidence. Dump the body where it was found. Where it will be found. And send the video to the media and the FBI. Decryption key. A equals uh, 1, B equals 2, J equals 10 plus 0 equals 1. Okay, this is... is this saved in my phone? Because this seems pretty important. Uh, okay, it is. Mm. Although, isn't that just uh, the decryption of the mm, of the method of the? Uh, let's go. Uh, B C D F G. No, oh, wait. I don't think this is the same. Uh, although maybe it is. Uh, K would be two. L. Three M four. Yeah, it is. It is the same. It is uh, like the explanation of how to transform. The numbers, mm, uh, the, the the letters into numbers for the purposes of of those codes that open the cells, uh, which I haven't even thought about it. I guess it's that you leave the um, decimal number out, and only have like the what's the other thing called the the other number. So for so ten is one, and twenty one would also be one. Digital fingerprints of Terence Curtis, a man already on police records. Wait, but let me take a look at this again. Loads of packs of gum, all the same brand. Brain Jack since 1884. A killer in the hands of another killer. Steel tension wrench. Okay, I do want that, but but let me go back to that file. Where is it actually? Load. I wanted to read the the report again. Computer box. 
pick gun without a battery. I do have a battery actually, so I do want to pick that up. I need to go to storage. But where's the other file? Because to be honest, I don't really remember at this point. Uh, you know, it, it has been some time. Uh, isn't Terence Curtis my other partner? My other partner. Looks like this grate was used as a weapon. Mm. David Carson's blood. Okay, that's actually pretty interesting. Because... what? He was supposedly the one that was in here, so... I guess he got injured, like, in a scaffold with Fernandez? Uh, and second, why do we even have his DNA? Like, I, I don't think it was noted anywhere that he was previously, mm, you know, engaged in any criminal activity. Uh, do I need a mine? I would prefer to keep this. Uh, Magnet and string. Uh, okay, I guess I don't need improvised picking tools if I will get actual picking tools. lockpick but the tension wrench is missing and the battery's gone mm, I do have the tension wrench actually right here uh, so I can combine uh, this and well I guess maybe I need the battery first with battery it is impossible to separate the part of these objects. Hmm. That's interesting and a bit weird because it very clearly says with a battery and this says without a battery so it seems like a match made in heaven to me. It says impossible to separate the parts. It doesn't say anything about space, so I doubt it's a space problem. Uh, now, it might be that I need to open uh, Paloma's cell, but it should be pretty easy if I only remember. Uh, it was Paloma Martinez, right? Mm, for the number, but I'll do it next time because this episode has been long enough, so I'm going to save and end it for now. That's all for this one, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!